before 20 things grow in Ontario. Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. And today we have a brand new product from AC Infinity. You've seen the name in the description. Um, AC Infinity sent me this to do some testing with it. So this is a pre-release video recording right now you're seeing. Uh, and full disclosure, they sent this to me to test. I did not pay for this. Um, but I do have some affiliate uh, coupon codes. So if you're looking to get one of these, you want to use the coupon code 420 things grow, all one word on their website. And there's a plethora of other ones and they'll be in the first comment and uh, also in the uh, description of this video. You can uh, save yourself uh, some stuff on items just like this. So let's get into this unboxing because I'm super excited for this. Because a lot of people I know, I see them out there, they're saying, oh man, they, the, the controller, it's a lot of money. Um, and, and it's a, you know, it's like, I, I don't want to use one of their controllers. Uh, I have, you know, I have a, a dehumidifier that's non-AC infinity that doesn't plug into their controller. I have an air conditioning unit or heater or dehumidifier or humidifier. There's a bunch of different things you could use with this that are, that you can control now with this without the controller. Why? Because this is a controller. It's called the Outlet AI Environmental Controller. Right, so let's 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 get into this. And I've pulled the book out because I've done some reading, and this is how I know all this information without going into this. Um, but let's let's get into it. So this is the four. This is the the AI controller, not the AI Plus. So this one has four plugs. Oh, there's the. Yeah, there's the the. Uh, let's, and that's it. The power cable, the power bar. Uh, let's see. Let's get this out and see how much of a distance we have here. Ish. We'll see. Because this is definitely a, it's about six feet. Because I'm six feet tall, a little shorter, but I digress. Okay, so it has, what, what it has here is it has two sensor ports. The other rubber thing went flying over there Got when I tried to pull it out. So it's got two sensor ports, UIS. So what is that for, because some of you might be coming to this video because you don't have one of their AI Plus controllers, or the 69 Pro, or the 69, or even the 67. There's a whole bunch of different ones, right? So what this does is, you, it, it's two sensor ports, UIS sensor ports. So there's a new new sensor that does relative humidity and temperature, okay, in all in one. And that's this sort of metal one that you're used to if you used any of ACI stuff. But this end is UIS, okay? So, and it's a sensor. It has a little picture of a, of a thermometer, per se, and that's a sensor port. So, there's a sensor here that tells you relative humidity and temperature. Now, if you were to plug this outside of your tent and bring this inside of your tent, okay, well, then you'd have outside temperature and inside temperature, humidity, and vice versa, okay? Now, that's handy when, you're, when, when you want to know what your lung room is versus your tent, right? Now, that being said, relative humidity here and temperature. And you have a second one here for that same thing. Well, why wouldn't you be able to put those other two things? But regardless of any of that, with this sensor, heat, heat, temperature, and humidity, you can control stuff like plug one could be an AC. Plug two could be a heater. Plug three could be a humidifier. And plug four could be a dehumidifier. So I know right now AC Infinity doesn't have a dehumidifier. So I know a lot of people are using dehumidifiers in their tents that aren't AC Infinity. And they're using whether it be an Inkbird or some sort of other sensor to control it. Or maybe you have one of those AC Infinity, you know, plugs that plugs into it, USI, UIS into it, and then controls it. But this is all one unit, okay? This is up to uh, 15 amps. 1800 watts so that's a fair bit um i know my heater is i think it's 1100 watts in the one tent i have and the dehumidifier takes a fair bit um but 1800 watts max for this whole bar 15 amps if you were to tr go and, and you were to plug in 20 amps per se it's not good don't do it but if you were it's got a trigger on it right it trips and then it goes oh no and then it shuts off power and then you wouldn't, it, it's like a circuit breaker, right? You got to push the button, hold it, reset it. There's a bunch of stuff you got to do. It's all outlined in your, your literature here, okay? So there is several different things you could probably combine with this. But I, I think a lot of people are going to do 
heat and humidity that don't have an uh, you know an ACI uh, controller currently, like the AI controller, the 69 Pro, and you don't have the abilities to use those plugs because you don't have one of those plugs. So this is like an all-in-one unit, a controller that connects to your phone. You, you go right in the app. This has... Uh, uh, this will be a whole unit itself. It'll have four different ports, which you can control with the app. You can do this Wi-Fi. You can do this Bluetooth. I'm going to be doing a Wi-Fi because I love the ability to get on the ACI Infinity app when I'm not at home, right? So that's that's the beauty of this. It's like having, without having a full-blown ACI controller controlling your fans, your inlines, all those other things, you can get to some non-ACI equipment control it right with this so that's pretty cool man and like i said heat 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 ac i could see that being one uh you know you, you shut you you have your heat come on when it's colder than this boom you leave a little bit of a buffer room there and then you say okay if it gets there the heat comes on oh it's too hot boom it goes there and if it gets higher than that you have like a one or a two degree you know difference between so that heater shuts off boom the air conditioner shoots on right because you might want to have your 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 heater on when the lights are off to keep the temperatures you know up to par and then when the lights come on they're going like crazy and then you're going to want to cool at a different time so you, you do want to make sure you don't overlap those things especially if it's going to exceed that 1800 watts right but other than that i'm gonna i'm just gonna i'm gonna do some i'm gonna put this on pause i'm gonna do some testing here with a few different items and we're gonna come right back all right, I'm back. I did some testing, and I ran into some issues. That's not a big deal, man. These these pre-release testing items, that's what it is. You you run into an issue. You, there's a, we, we do the, we, we we fill out a form. We, we we send back our findings, and and then the dev team does what they do, right? I I don't know what they do because I'm not on that side of it. But uh, I've reported the issue. Um, they, they've told me that they, they think they're going to get a defective item. Um, they're going to, you know, send me out a new one. I'll do some more testing once I get the new one. But at the time of this video, unboxing, first thoughts, you know, like how what I'm going to plug in here, what I think this is useful for. Because, man, this is pretty cool, man. I still don't know the price point. And I don't know all that stuff. So it's kind of hard for me to tell, you know, hey, this is a great deal compared to the, the, the controller. And if you have some other things, I'm not 100% sure. Check the link in the description because when I put this video out, there will be a link because they're going to release it on their page. You'll see the price, all right? Sorry I couldn't do much more. That's the nature of testing, right? I love it. I love trying to break things, and, and that's that's what happens. New items. You got to test it. You got to put it. Good on AC Infinity. I know they sent out some, uh, some requests for more testers, so I know they're testing all their stuff, so that's cool. You got to test it to get to the bottom of the things, right? But when you get a defective unit on a brand new thing, it happens. All right, guys, I'm going to be done with this. This is the end of the video. Um, head on over to their site, check it out. Links in the description. And um, use the coupon code 420 things grow, and you'll get a discount. Or check the ones in the description or the pinned comment. Get yourself one of these without having a need for uh, the uh, full AI controller.